She had enough donuts one day. Don't you see the the box there? It's there, it's right in front of you. Jesus. Hey hey everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Ghost Trick Phantom Detective. Last episode, we discovered that we were dead. Dead and able to possess 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 things around us, such as guitars and other things. So, I know I did a lot of mistakes last episode and the sound wasn't really great. Let's see if this time this goes well. Okay, so let's continue, shall we? Okay, I hope it's not too loud for you guys, but to me it's a bit loud, so I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Okay, so we were going to chapter 2, 7.31 p.m. That's not real time, that's in-game time. Start from this time frame, yes, sure, why not? Ghost Street Chapter 2. So, where we left off, it's exactly here. We were going to meet our killer. Who am I? Why was I killed? The one who is sure to know the answer to those questions is the man who ordered my murder. My mother, my murder. At the other end of the phone line is the very man who had me killed. Yes, we learned how to go through uh, the lines, the phone lines. Our meeting, it's all so sudden. I am not so. I'm not sure. I'm re really prepared for what's to come. It's going to be a big boss. Here we go. We arrived. Hello. Mm, yes. If what I'm a reader in this file is true, uh, this woman could be uh, quite a, a bed bedwelling, 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 or oh, whatever. Bit of trouble for us. Uh, she needs to be erased tonight. Confound that nearsighted Jigo. His skills are as feeble as his has high sight. Eyesight. Not to worry, sir. I have already taken the next step, sir. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, yeah. Slap the machine. Yeah, make it work. Oh, yeah. Here's the girl. Hmm, yes. But I say, the last thing I have ever expected was to talk to the target herself. Even if it was only over the phone. I must admit, my good man, I um, it put me in quite the, the teasy. There for a moment. <laughs> what is this place? These oddly luxurious furnishings. This oddly refined music and that odd little machine I have never seen a room like this before but one thing's for sure these people are assassins and what's more that red-headed woman is another of their targets mm, that file the old man has maybe it gives me some information on my red hair so, new information on the database so we can check it, but not right now. I'm going to turn into a ghost and check that file for a second and go back and see if we can get some info. So, what's the conversation right now? Mm, yes! How much longer, my good man? We are changing our power back up. Power now, sir? The process will be complete in about 30 minutes, sir. Mm, yes! But confirm that, Jigo, I said. Um, I say, sorry. Uh, every year, his reliable range gets shorter and shorter. He'll get call in his next pay envelope, confound it. Oh, might I suggest glasses in his envelope instead, sir? That's quite interesting, actually. Oh, I can trick, uh, I can trick it. Let's trick it. It seems this file contains information about that redhead, but I can't read it when it's closed. The pong. Whoa! It opened by itself! Great Scott, did you see that? The file, I say. The file re re reared up, uh, snapped at me. A good, my good man nearly bit me, me, me head off. <laughs> no worries, sir. 
I already seen it to uh, I already need to do it that the target Miss Leanne Lion Line Liney is Miss Liney, right? Liney. Or maybe Liney. Let's call her Liney, whatever. Uh is no longer a threat, sir. Bah! It's not what I'm talking about, man! Hmm, Liney, hmm? Uh, so, uh, that's her name, is it? But this file... It's like it's written in a foreign language, I can't read it at all. Might I suggest putting away the file and relaxing, sir? Pang! Oh crap, I'm in the file now. I can reach that on top now, maybe. Alright, so... Oh, yeah, fruit, take that! You have a very important job ahead of you tonight, sir! <laughs> Alright, so let's, uh... What's your thoughts, darn? This is a pickle, the phone is got... Uh, the, the phone and I got put away in neatly, okay. Um, the only thing I've learned is names were Liney, okay. And, uh, yeah, we room, travel, through, phone line of stuff, uh, okay, alright. So basically we can't, we have to reach the phone again, but I think we can do some tricks instead, so the lamp doesn't do anything, I can operate this, let's try. Oh, goodness! Hey, God, man! Are you trying to give me a case of vapor, of the vapors? My apologies, sir, but I didn't touch it, sir. It appears the equipment is still malfunctioning, sir. Bah! Granted, technology is certainly a convenient thing, but our use of it is just plain off, confound it. Mm, yes, in, c in any case, I don't wish to see the face of the current... of our current target, my good man. As you wish, sir. In that case, I might... might I suggest this, sir? Okay, uh... Oh. Wow, it's me. Hey, that, that, that's... Hmm, yes, Cecil. Or Cecil. Uh, Cecil. If all goes well with our deal tonight, we will have the power to change the world, sir. Mm, yes, um, it's a very important night indeed, my good man. Uh, we can't afford to make any mistakes, and that is that is why we can't afford to trust that Sissel. No, we must be very careful. Careful! Shut up, phone, once again, Jesus. Cecil. That must be my name. Now that I hear it, it does sound familiar. A deal, eh? Hey? What, what could that be all about? Just what exactly was I up to, I wonder? Now, there's a, there are some dark secrets in this game, for sure. Interesting. Who am I? Am I a killer or am I an assassin? I'm probably working for this guy. We are completely prepared for tonight, sir. Mm. Delicious grapes. Mm, yes! Now, all we have to do is pluck the fruits of success. <laughs> joke I did there, you see I did there, sir? One thing's clear, these villains seem to know me. And another thing, there seem to be a kind of a connection between me and this lion. Lion, <laughs> lion, liney. Uh, why else would our names both come up here like this. I'm so sorry, I'm reading like crap. As always. Okay, can I actually reach something? Nope. I might be able to... Uh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe not. I can operate this again, I guess. What is your head, man? I told you I don't wish to see this face. My apologies, sir. It appears to be another malfunction, sir. 
Well, get it fixed, man, and you, unless you want to see me malfunction. Certainly, sir. Okay, can I... Uh, uh, I can't do anything. These guys murdered me and now they're targeting their redhead. What kind of connection did we have with each other? Hmm. So what now? Spinning this painting around makes the old man's head spin. But what about it? What about it? Uh, I got to find the right timing to get beyond this projector. Okay, uh, that's what I thought. Yeah, that's what I thought. Trick. Again, and now ghost. I can now possess the painting and uh, maybe wait for it to come back to what it was. We read that. Yeah, it's exactly the same text. Okay, let's move on then. Flip this back again, sir. Thank you so much. These guys murdered me and now they're targeting the redhead. I know exactly what you said because you're repeating yourself again once again. Can I trick this? No, I can trick the fruit, but I can operate this, which is fun. Shut up, phone. Haha, <laughs> cool. Now we've flipped everything, and now we I think we might be able to possess that phone again. It's a miserable state of affairs when you can even... Uh, when I can even be started by a phone that doesn't even ring! Egat! Oh my goodness, that was such a timing. It's even more pathetic to be startled by the same phone twice, bah! The problem must be solved, sir. The Miss Liney problem, sir. What? Liney? Hmm, yes. You didn't mention uh, taking the next step a moment ago, didn't you, my good man? Yes, I sent... I, uh, yes, sir, I sent one step ahead Tango to her apartment, sir. That telephone, uh, that telephone call must be him reporting in, sir. Very good, very good. So, most likely, uh, yeah, she's home, maybe, and we're going to save her again. I mean, I mean, that was my guess. Liney is in danger again. Yep. Go, 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 go. Don't think twice. Let's possess things. This is one step ahead, Tingo. Um, I am at the target's apartment now. And out with it, man! Have you taken care of her? No, she isn't back yet. What? No, the only... Uh, I, it only stands to reason. If the target uh, got, uh, her, got here first, they wouldn't call me one step ahead. Now, would they? Yeah, I see. I don't get it! But in any case, man, once you've taken care of her, then I'll prom then you'll promote me to the head of the Hitman division. Bah! No, man, you're you're even getting one step ahead of me. Now you <laughs> we can discuss my new salary later. Great, Scott! Now you're even getting on one step ahead of your last one, the last one step ahead. I'll get the job. I'll get, I'll get to my to how? Oh, wow, I can't even read. I'll get back to my job now, sir. Confound it! We're even hanging up one step ahead. Oh, he's genius. I love this man. Trace complete. And now we can go to Liney's apartment. Cool. I like this mechanic. What did he say, sir? He asked me to raise his salary. What will you do, sir? Maybe I'll give him some of uh, nearsighted Jigo's pay. Liney, I can't lose her. She's my only lead. If I ever hope to solve this mystery of me. Well, I read like crap, so sorry. Yeah, I can now, I'm on the phone, so maybe dial? Yeah, and I can go to Liney's apartment. Let's go. Oh wow, I'm really sorry for my reading, but yeah, you know, English is not my my language. Uh, I try though. I you probably know me from other videos. I already said that a ton of times. So here's the guy. 
sitting down on the couch. The phone line guided me to Lainey's apartment. Unfortunately, Lainey is not here yet, but... Fortunately, Lainey is not here yet, but unfortunately, the hitman is. And there are a couple of other unfortunate little development waiting for me to see... For, waiting for me, it seems. Mm-hmm. There's a girl. Mm-hmm. Looks like there's an unlucky girl, uh, an unlucky lady here tonight. And an even unluckier little doggy. A poor brave little warrior. He must have been trying to defend his mistress. Alright. If L Liney comes home now, I have to do something about this situation and fast. And that's what we're going to do, trick time! So what can we do? First, go to ghost mode uh, and uh, try to possess possess the dog. Why not? Oh, where am I? And more to the point, who am I? Who am I? Uh, are you talking to me? Of course. Do you see anybody else around here? Uh, if I can remember right, and the dead don't have voices, their thoughts reach the person, the other person directly. I guess that explains why the dog is talking to me right now. Okay, interesting. Uh, this is your mistress's apartment, and you are presumably the little doggy who died here. Died? I'm so I'm dead, huh? Let's see. The the dead lose their memory. They even forget what they look like and so that's what it uh, oh that's what this blue flame shape is all about oh there's no time to lose miss camilla my miss camilla is in trouble you mean you remember you know who you are that's right i'm missile nice to meet you missile i am a P uh, Pomeranian. P Pomer Pomeranian. Wow, that's dog names, dog species. I don't know. Well, well, I guess now I'm. I know it's possible for the dead to remain uh, to regain their memories thanks to this little doggy. Miss Camilla, Miss Camilla, Miss Camilla is in trouble, and I vowed to devote my life to protect her. But I died before I could res rescue her. Hmm. How could I let her down like this? You're more worried about your mistress safely than your own death. Safety than your own death, hey? I like your moxie, little doggy. It looks like it's time to go back to four minutes before this l this little guy's death. Time to save his this. Time to time to save this his life. Okay, nice. And now, rewind time, because it's the only option on screen once again. I wish I could go back and just forget about the doggy and do something else. Just kidding. Okay. Mm, let's see. First of all, I'd better see what I can find out about your death, little guy. Excuse me, but where exactly are we? Huh, you followed me. I followed you. I you brought me with you, uh, one or the other. Hmm. It looks like the dead can move around together. Uh, this is the land of four minutes before your death. The land of four minutes before your death. That's cool. Really? We we're really here? So that means we're go we're going to save Miss Camilla, doesn't it? Aren't you even surprised? I mean, just traveled through. T uh, we just traveled through time, and not not especially. I mean, Miss Camilla can walk around on, can walk around two legs, but I can't do that. So if she can do that, then it's not so strange that you can walk backwards through time. So that's the way your mind works. Hey, I guess that's reasonable enough. Come on, come on, let's get started. 
Okay, first we watch our last four minutes unfold, then we use what we learned to save Camilla. Just like when I saved Liney at the junkyard. If we watch closely, we ought to be able to get a few leads. Keep your eyes open. Of course! Leave it to me to sniff out a few clues. Oh yeah, I would have said all the clues, but whatever. Trying to read me not with my eyes closed. So she comes back from under the couch. Yippee F on the remote. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Turns on the TV. And the dog starts barking like crazy. And uh, whoever this is. Which is the... Whoa, neighbors have a heavy fist. Shut up, dog. No, missile, you're not supposed to bark. The lady next door is crabbier than ever tonight. What happened? Hey, lady. If it barks again, I'll knock this wall down. Okay. That's what all bad neighbors say. You don't want to... Would You don't want her to knock the wall down, do you, boy? Oh, she has such a deep voice. Why do you like to bark so much, anyway? You sure are cute, but just don't get us killed, okay? Darn, I really wanted to watch TV too. Hey, you know? Hey, I know. I'll listen to music. Oh, that's a bad idea. Because if you can't hear anything, you won't be able to hear any, you know. Oh, wow. That almost fell in the water. I wish it did. Hmm. Maybe I could use that. I don't know. I'm in the mood for some donuts tonight. No, that in four minutes. See? How time flies. Then the doggy sees the donuts. Oh no, it's a mouse. Oh, okay, okay. Go doggy! Chase! And it, he barks again. I'll knock this wall down! I'll call the police! No, I won't call the police because I'm a mafia. Oh, wow. Hello? Hello? Hmm, I don't really like it when jobs outside the original scope crop up. I have to put put it down as a separate charge and accounting never likes that. But I guess it can be helped. Sorry, kid. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, doggy. Poor thing. Now we know. So, that's the whole dramatic story of what happened four minutes before you died. Oh, look at that, I'm dead. Look at that, I'm dead. I'm kind of shocked to tell the truth. Okay, let's get started on saving her. But let's see. What are we going to do? Uh, what? How are we going to do this? It seems to me that the easiest way would be for you to take a big bite out of that man's leg. Oh, I, I don't do. I don't think that would do. I would do that. Uh, whenever somebody I don't know comes around, all I want to say to them is, Welcome! I can't help it. Well, okay. Uh, then I guess the only thing we can do is get. The little lady to help herself somehow? I don't think she could do that. Did you notice her putting those red things on her head? Red things? Oh, you mean the headphones. Uh, whenever she puts those red things on, that's it. I can call her name until my throat is sore, but she never hears me. To be perfectly honest, I hate those red things. Hmm, you're right. With those headphones on, our little lady doesn't even hear the sound of the intruder's gun. So maybe that's how... that's our first lead. Now, we know we have to do something about that. So yeah, that's, that's what I was thinking. I think we have to get rid of those headphones. Because clearly, that's the whole problem. So for, first, let's go ghostly. 
and try to reach that. Yeah, I can reach that. Can I trick it right away? Oh, cool. <coughs> Yippee, I found a remote. Oh, so close. Almost knocked down the red things. Uh, those red things down. And I think we're onto something here. Uh, first drop them, fish tank. Camilla won't be able to use them anymore. But if we drop them in the fish tank, Camilla, uh, Camilla will get a scolding from Miss L uh, Liney. All you have to do is pretend that it was your fault. That's the way of the honorable warrior. Okay. But you're obviously, you obviously, uh, you've obviously never seen Miss Liney uh, when she gets mad. <clears throat> okay, um, what now? I, well, can't, can't really change a little lady's fate by standing here. Uh, okay, well, introduce, uh, okay. All right. Okay, okay, uh, let's see. What can we do? Can I trick this to open somehow? Oh, I see, I see. Okay, okay. Hmm. Wait a second. Let's go back here. Can I trick this back? Yes, I can. Ooh, and what now? Okay, uh, basically... Yeah, we don't need to read this again. We're going to trick the lady right on time. That's that's the idea. So she will grab try to grab the headphones and now Ha! In the water. Screw that. No headphones for you, girl. How did that manage to do that? Lynn just bought those headphones too. Well, it's to save your life. Or at least your situation. How about we, uh, if we tell her you did it, missile? Missile, sorry. Um, darn. Now I can't even listen to music either. I think the gods are playing tricks on me tonight. Forgive me, Miss Camilla. I'm till I'm only doing it to save you. So what? Now you think you're you're one of the gods, hey? Hey, no, never mind that. The important thing is we managed to change to change to change the situation. Read properly. That's true. At least now we can use the little lady's ears to help us. Okay, that's that, that's good. Fate changed. All right. We have more time. Is it? Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Maybe. Mood for donuts tonight? Cool, cool. Perfect. Your perfect position. Now I can pretty much. Maybe I can move the cart. Rock the ball. Move the cart. Okay, let's move the cart first. I, I need to get over there. I don't know, I'm just saying. Where'd the donuts go? Yeah, can I... Oh, no. Okay, she's over there now. That's cool. I can rock this now, maybe. And make a mouse appear, maybe, on the other side? Okay, pink mouse. That works. Ghost. Let's go here. I can play this. Shut that mud up! I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, hey, oh, cool, cool. Is this going to help? Oh, perfect timing. Actually, this is rotating, rotating. Oh, okay, cool. Um. All right. Um. Let's see. Can I reach the ball? Yeah, I can reach the ball. That's cool. Open. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool. Under, under the sofa. Now let's let's go. Cool. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm doing things. So 
I'm guessing we want them to go under the... Uh, oh, I can spin this faster, right? Um, I'm guessing we need them to go under uh, the... Um, the sofa? Alright, so let's trick this to open. I noticed this on top. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a music box, is it? Okay, let's go back now. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, you can go slower now. Thank you. And, uh, trick here. Exactly, perfect. And now we can play it. Maybe she will notice that now. Again. And shut that mat once again. Can you see it? No? No. Still nothing. Hmm. Oh, I wanted to read those, those thoughts. What if I... Let, let's see if I can pop the bubble here once it appears. I'm kind of lost. Okay, pop, pop the bubble. What exactly are you barking about anyway? Well, just look at it. It's sparkly and glittery and it's, it, it turns around and around and besides it plays that exciting music. What else can I do but bark? Tell me this then. Exactly what are you thinking when you bark like that? <laughs> well, let's see. That time there, if I had to put my feelings into words, I'd say they, w they were welcome! I guess that about sums it up. The final... Uh, okay. What to do, what to do. No, no, it has to go to this side. She has to move to the other side now. Oh no, it's... Oh no, time is, is running out! Time is running out! Come on, trick. Come on, come on. Do something! Come on, look at me, senpai! To be honest, I don't know. Oh, I know! Oh, what a dumb... Oh, I'm so stupid. I, I oh, wasted so much time. I can spotlight it. There's a light there. Oh, but I don't know. I can turn it on. What about this? Painting. Okay. No, no. Can I rock this more? No. Yeah, forget it. Oh, it's time for death. Yeah. No, no. Ah! No, really, I kind of know what I'm trying to do, but I don't know how to. Now she's going to be... Okay. What a shame. And that... Oh, okay. Time's up. Hmm. I guess... Hmm. Finding... Uh, people often tell me why, uh, uh, tell me my name doesn't suit me. It's the only thing is to hide the lady somewhere. Okay, yeah, that's, that's uh, the idea was behind, the, uh, under the couch, but what am I doing wrong? Hmm. After change, fate. Yeah, after fate change. I can just move along and have my point done. I mean, this is tricky, guys. If you don't look up a guide or anything, you'll really stay here figuring things out. Maybe you figured it out and you probably face palming, but I didn't. I'm I'm doing this blind, so. No, she did. She doesn't even want donuts now. She had enough donuts one day. Don't you see the the box there? It's there. It's right in front of you. Jesus. Let's go back after the change. Alright, so guys, sorry about that cut. Um, I actually had to uh, answer a phone call. So I'm back to this, and I think we don't want her to get that first. We need to save her. That's, that's the priority. And I don't want to uh, go ahead and... 
you know, risk her life for that. Priority number one is saving her. Maybe the cutscene afterwards makes her uh, get get that. I don't know. Uh, to be honest, I, I'm not sure what I'm doing. So we don't want the mouse first. What I'm going to do is try to bring that thing down and let it rest here. So, yep. Spin around, boys! Spin around, and... Stop. Good. We open this, and, uh, we... We have... Now we have everything ready, basically. I don't want to rush things out, but if I can't make her grab that, and it's there, it's because there is a reason, and I don't want to rush things out. So let's... Let's go one step at a time. I thought about it a little bit more, and maybe... Well, that's not a good idea. Maybe I should go back. Maybe what we need to do is save her first, and afterwards the cutscene would... That's my guess. Well, let's see. Maybe maybe I can just play it once. Hmm. Oh, there's a ball there. I wonder what the ball is for. That's that's what bothers me. Maybe maybe she finds the ball and puts it on the tree and then I don't know. Let's knock the ball there either way. So basically, yeah, you knock the ball, it knocks things be below. That's I think that's probably to tell you how that works. That's my wild guess because it doesn't do really anything for her safety. So what I'm going to do is rock this <clears throat> back and forth. That's how I understood that it would go under the sofa. <laughs> uh, let's see. Can I reach? No, I can't. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -da -boom. No, quickly, quickly. Let's knock the rat under the sofa. Boom. Good. I think we set everything up correctly, right? Now we saved both of them. And the ball is under the sofa, I don't know why, but maybe it's going to be useful somewhere. But I won't stress out because of this. I don't want to lose the game just because of a stupid music box that I don't know how to get, so I just want to get, uh, get going with it. Okay, he opens the door, comes in. Alright, so I guess we saved the situation? And that's the most important thing. Nobody's here, huh? All right. Okay, let's let's see. My prey is bound to be to come home sometime. Might as well make myself comfortable. In um, meanwhile, in the meanwhile, yes, I think you should. I think you should definitely. There, our little lady's fate has been inverted. So I guess that's all right. I mean. I hope this comes in handy later in the story. I don't know. It has? The poor thing is still curled up in a ball and shaking with fear. Well, yeah, that's true. But it's not so bad. In the scheme of things, she is just... She, I'd say she's just fine. And look, you're not dead. Alright! Oh, you're right! Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, well, uh, we d we did it. We did we did didn't we? We did it. Well, to be precise, you're the one who did it. Huh? Me? I said Miss Camilla. Yup. You're the one who led her into this uh, under the sofa, right? Into the sofa, of course. Uh, you you protected your mistress. I can attest to that. Oh. Thank you. Freighted footage. Now, can I ask you a question? Uh, sure, what is it? What exactly are those strange powers of yours? Oh, uh, you mean my ghost tricks? Apparently, they're the powers to manipulate. Uh, they're the powers to manipulate an, an animated object. An animated object. Um, if you're, if they're ghost tricks, then can I do them too? I'm dead too, after all. I guess uh, that's how it goes, right? I've been starting 
Uh, I've been staring at those donuts as hard as I could for for a long time now, but they won't budge for me. Why do you uh, how, why do you suppose that is? I don't know, real. I don't really know. Uh, I guess just I guess you just don't have that power. Well, I have one thing to say to that. That's not fair. Draw all because donuts. Sorry, but I guess not everybody who dies gets the power of the dead. So what's going to happen to me now? Well, nothing really. Um, your dead has been uh, erased. You'll just go back to being a happy little doggy living your everyday life. I guess this means goodbye. But we'll meet again sometime, right? Yeah, maybe if you die again. <laughs> oh my gosh! What what did uh, what uh, what you did for me tonight? I'll never forget it. Hey. <laughs> Well, uh, I guess I'd better be getting back to the present. Time to see what happens next in our story. Ooh. So mysterious. Let's go back then. And now a new present is born. And that thing is still there, so... I don't know. I'm really focused on getting this, I don't know why. Uh, it's, it felt like some kind of secret or important or something, I don't know. This lady is still curled up in a ball and shaking with fear. And the little dog is wagging his tail happily. So what am I going to do now? I think I'll watch for a while and see what happens. That's, so that's actually good because maybe we can still interact with this? I don't know. Oh yeah, we get we gotta get to the phone. That's right. Uh, we gotta get out of here. So yeah, I'm guessing that's when we do something. Still at the junkyard. All right, got it. I'm on my way. Still at the junkyard. Hmm. I guess my prey likes to hide to play hide and seek. She hasn't had enough of that junkyard yet. Apparently, I can't let. Nearsighted Jigo beat me out on this one. I'd better hurry. Well, he's already dead with a ball up on his face, so it's it's fine though. Giant ball of doom. Took the life of the poor guy. And we wake up from the shaky slumber. What was that all about? Well, I was asking the same question. You saved me, didn't you, missile? Missile! <laughs> read properly I just know you did no oh, gosh darn it maybe I shouldn't answer it what now liney trick time oh, okay well yeah of course so we can still trick things I can't do anything with that but I can reach the phone and hear the conversation oh wait there's that little doggy all curled up on the floor dreaming away the life we worked so hard to get back for him that's fine but what's up with that core the dead can possess live can, can possess living creatures that's one of the rule that mr. desk lab taught me Test club. So, what would a living and breathing doggy be doing with a core? I'd better try possessing him and see. Let's connect with him. Oh, it's you! It's you! It's um. Come to think of it, I never did ask you your name. I never did ask you your name. I guess that's good. We run into each other again then. Uh. This is a good chance for us to reintroduce ourselves to each other. You mean you forgot my name already? Uh, after everything we shared together, the drama, that tearful goodbye, I miss all! But you know, it's strange. I wonder why you remember me now that you're alive again. 
Do you remember you had y your time be being dead? Of course, all of it. Okay, let me get this straight. The memories of being dead doesn't disappear. Disappear, and the dead I meet in the ghost world develop a core when they return to the l to the land of the living. Okay. And if I didn't possess, possess that core, I can talk to that person. Looks cool that way, uh, well, yes. Interesting. So let's trick this. Go check the phone call. I can listen to the conversation a little bit. Okay, here's Liney. Camilla! Oh, thank goodness. You're okay. Oh, thank goodness you're okay, girl. Well, I don't know if I'm okay exactly. I won't... Uh, you won't believe uh, what I just have... Uh, listen to me! I've got to get... Uh, you've got to get out of here right now. But what about dinner? What was I thinking about... Uh, I was thinking about spaghetti tonight. I won't be going back there for a while. And you might be in danger if you stay there too. But I was, but I already was in danger, I, uh, just a little while ago. Meet me at the restaurant, the chicken kitchen, on Dead End Drive. Dead End Drive? I don't know, it's pretty far. Just hurry, okay? Oh, and one more thing, bring the music box. Oh, okay, that, there's the music box, there's the gosh darn the music box I was talking about. Made me lose the game. With you, okay? Music box? I love music boxes. Is it a present for me? I'm sorry, but it doesn't play. I can't even get it get the lid open. But then can uh, but uh, then you can't uh, very well call it a music box, and can you? It's more just a box. Bring it, okay? It's kind of big. I mean, it's made out of wood. Okay, I will. Where is it? I kind of hid it in that in that room you're in. Oh, creepy guy. Excuse me. Eek! Liney, sploosh. More things in the in the water. I hope there's no fishes in there because they would be dead. Not again. Everything's going to water. No, I've dropped a phone in there too. How about if we tell her we did it? You did it, missile. Okay, don't put all the blames on me, okay? Um, but uh, uh, but I sure hope Pliny is all right. I better get going. I know right. Uh, uh, I know right where Dead End Drive is. But I never saw any music box around here. Where am I supposed to find it? Okay, that's that's now. Okay. Um, do you know where it is, missile? Uh, well, the doggy knows. Help me look, okay? All right, let's play the music now. Okay, I think I think it's a good timing. But we make this go all the way. Oh my gosh, the table moved by itself. And I'll play this. I'm guessing that's the only thing we need to do. Oh wait. I saw something. Oh, yes! Finally! She has it! Go away now. Run! This is it. The music box. Ta -na -na -na. Got the music box. Yeah, I leave the remote there. If the TV comes on, you'll start barking. I'd hate to, to find you flattering underneath that wall when I come home. Yeah, well, the neighbors is kind of, yeah. I have a feeling we have to meet that neighbor someday and teach her a lesson about doggies. Okay, I'm leaving now, Missile. I have to go help Liney. She's like a sister to me, you know? You'll be good while I'm away and no barking. Open the dang door. Or run away. Oh, it all went smoothly. I thought I was going to be to go crazy because of that music box. I don't know why. Still no peace for the little lady. 
and the uh, redhead Liney is facing a new crisis right now as well. I love that song, by the way. Meanwhile, I'm a bit of a I'm, a, I'm in a bit of a pickle on my own with the receiver at the bottom of the fish tank. I find myself still trapped in this apartment. Oh, that's right. We can't use the line now. Oh, wow. Inter interesting. So bad I can just curl up and go to sleep with my tail wagging too. Yeah, I like the doggy. Because there is something I must do. The question is, how do I go about getting out of here? Oh, okay. Interesting. Hmm. Maybe you can trick the dog to go out to the door. Let's save this. Save. And uh, we'll find out next episode, I guess, because now we're going to enter chapter three. Thank you so much for watching. Really sorry about the cut there. Uh, really sorry about wasting your time trying to figure out that whole music box thing. But of course, we will be back for more soon enough. And I hope this time I don't have to cut anything out uh, because of my stupidity and my stupid phone calls. So thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.